Shalom everyone. Today I'm going to be showing you a few of my drawings and art from a while ago. I'm going to show you how I did it and when I did it and all of that stuff. So stay tuned. Just so you know, I really enjoy doing art and the main thing I like to do is sketching. Lately I've been learning how to paint and other techniques too, but right now I'm the best at sketching. So I'm going to show you some of my sketch work. I'm going to start off with this one. See that clear? This particular picture was drawn June 10th of 2014. And see, I really like this picture. I kind of think it's special because when I drew this, it was the day my mom was giving birth to my little sister Yashiva and she was having a home birth. And so I was sitting outside the room at the table waiting and so I decided to get a piece of paper and just draw something. So this is what I drew. Yeah, and it was exactly 11.58 p.m. when I finished this. The day Yashima was born. So, if you can see, I just simply did a little sketch of a head. Most of the time when I do drawings, I start off with the head because it's like the easiest for me. I can, I can like see where the eyes will be placed and the nose and the lips and everything else. So I start with a basic head shape and then I went to the eyes. Like the eyes are the first thing I like to do because I don't know, I just find it easy. I find drawing humans period just very easy. So I started the head shape and then the eyes and I just did a basic like shape kind of like that. I just kind of sometimes I do like erase around it to get the shape perfect and put eyelashes on and everything, but that's what I did, a basic shape. I think I started the lips because sometimes I have a hard time with the nose, honestly. I think the hardest part on the face is the nose and the ears. Sometimes I actually just put the hair over the ears so that I can avoid drawing them, period. But then the nose after the ears is like the hardest. So if I can get the eyes and maybe the eyelashes and the lips, then I can perfectly find a place for the nose to make it look realistic. Now, not all of my drawings look realistic, like real, but it looks good enough. It looks like a very detailed cartoon character or something. So that's how I did it. And so I went, I did the eyes. Well, first the head shape, the eyes, the lips. I think I did the eyelashes and the nose. Like sometimes the nose is the last thing and I like to get it the perfect shape for the character. And normally the body shape is really easy as well. I just do a little line like that across for the arm shape and stuff like that. And it's really easy. I'll show an up close of it. Okay, so here's a close up of the picture I was talking about. A close up. And I just wanted to show you like some basic lines, how I did some of the face, the lips, the head shape. It was very simple. So I just did like a, this head shape is very unrealistic as you can see, but I did a simple line like that. Both lines are almost identical. So a very curved line that kind of get pointed at the chin area right here. And then the head, the top part of the head I kind of did like that and I just added some hair on top like that quick little you know something quick as you can see and um, yeah it's a very simple drawing if you really look at it but yeah like I said it I did this a year like three years ago and I think I could do a lot better now but just looking at this you can tell that it's very simple and it I think this is probably an intermediate sketch I don't think it's advanced because I've seen so many better sketches out there and like I said sketching is something I love to do so I did like a lot of research on it and everything so yeah okay so now that I showed you a little bit about this drawing it's time for me to go to the next one, which would be this one, if you could see it. This was a picture, I actually showed it in um, my intro video as one of my drawings that I did. 
but um this one was kind of hard I must say it was kind of hard because I got this from an exact photo and I tried to do the shading and you know everything perfect I'm like if I'm trying to draw something exactly the way I see it like on a picture or something I want it to be exactly like that I am um, of course I know that this particular image that I drew wasn't you know someone else's image but I drew it because I just thought it was a nice shot of her this is Katara from um, Avatar and the Last Airbender and this one was kind of hard I had to get the shape the, her head shape perfect like I said this is the first thing I like to do is get the head shape perfect and once I did that I I think I did the hair afterwards because that kind of gave me an image it kind of made it fuller and easier to start in the inside of her face and like the shading and everything if I could get her head shape and her hair shape right so I got that part done and then I went I think I went straight to the eyes the eyes were the shape were very interesting so the shape was very interesting so when I did the shape of the eyes it kind of helped me see how she would look it took me I think all day or a few days to complete this photo so yeah I wanted to make sure everything was perfect so that's why it took me so long with that okay so around the time I did this drawing me, my sister, and my brother was really into watching Avatar The Last Airbender. And for some reason, I really liked the character, Katara. She was like one of my favorites. So I was like, if I can draw her, that would be like super cool. That would be cool. Now, I do think this is either intermediate or advanced, whichever one. I know I've seen some very advanced sketchings that were like far better than this. I was like, wow. But this, I think, can be considered advanced especially compared to like what some people can do like stick figures and stuff so this is the drawing complete drawing these are the two pictures that i showed in the video katara from avatar last airbender and this other random drawing that i did in june 10th 2014 when my little sister was born so yes these are the two pictures that i drew Hope you all like them and I hope you all enjoy the video. I'll also try to upload videos a lot more soon. And I'll try to be more active on my channel and yeah, I hope you like these two pictures that I showed in the video. And don't forget to subscribe, comment, share, and like. Thanks for watching.